when you look at lots of different competitors across the space, even if you're focusing kind of solely on digital content, how are you differentiating and then what's kind of contributing to that growth that you're seeing? I mean, I think the growth came from really building a better product and making it more accessible. I mean, a lot of, if you look at the fit, fitness industry, if you think about like a typical gym or a traditional fitness app, most of them would kind of lock you out of the system. You know, they, they wanted you to sign up, pay up front, but they didn't really care if you showed up and worked out. We've really flipped the industry on the head and really focused on engagement and retention and, and really building an active user base of people that are actually using the product. And we're super fortunate our first year in the business, we actually didn't focus on monetization. We just focused on engagement and retention and how do you get people using the platform and telling everyone they knew about it and then really move to turn on monetization after that. And so it was hugely helpful for our growth. We're really trying to design more of a high organic growth machine with massive word of mouth. Over 50% of Fitons growth today comes from word of mouth and people telling their friends about it and then really layering in a better product experience with a social experience on top of it. Social and community has really been the foundation of the product. So when you join Fiton, we encourage you to add your friends to the platform, take a workout with them. You get notified when your, your friend does activity on the platform and you can invite your friends and coworkers to participate with you, whether it's challenges or we have a really cool feature called Fit on Party where you can do a live workout together and have an awesome social feed. And so a lot of it was about designing a better product with kind of a five-star product experience that was better than what was out there. And so we really happened to love health and fitness, but we were building a technology product in the health and fitness space. And it was less about an individual trainer or kind of locking people out of the platform. It was about inviting them in, making it super motivating and sticky and engaging once you were in the platform and really trying to focus on word of mouth and social sharing as a, a key component. We're really expanding beyond health and fitness and broadening the offer where you can work out on fit on. We're really expanding into creating that number one wellness companion in your pocket that is there for you throughout your day. 